for another Wiki Wednesday, this time covering another popular pet in North America, cats. I know that dogs are supposed to hate cats, but I don't hate anyone. In fact, I've met a few cats so far in my young life, and I've been curious about them all. So I'm eager to learn more about cats along with you today. If you want to read along, click the link in the description to Kittle, the kids' encyclopedia. Ready? Let's start. Cat Facts for Kids Cats, also called domestic cats, are carnivorous, or meat-eating mammals of the family Felidae. Cats have been domesticated, or tame, for nearly 10,000 years. They are currently the most popular pet in the world. Their origin is probably the African wildcat Felis sylvestris libica. Cats were probably first kept because they ate mice, and this is still their main job in farms throughout the world. Later, they were kept because they are friendly and good companions. A young cat is called a kitten. Cats are sometimes called kitty or pussycat. An entire female cat is a queen, and an entire male cat is a tom. Domestic cats are found in short hair and long hair breeds. Cats which are not specific breeds can be referred to as domestic short hair or domestic long hair. The word cat is also used for other felines. Felines are usually classed as either big cats or small cats. The big cats are well known. Lions, tigers, leopards, jaguars, pumas, and cheetahs. There are small cats in most parts of the world, such as the lynx in northern Europe. The big cats and the wild cats are not tame and can be very dangerous. History. In the past, people kept cats because they hunted and ate mice, rats, and insects. The oldest evidence of cats kept as pets is from the Mediterranean island of Cyprus, around 7500 BC. Ancient Egyptians worshipped cats as gods and often mummified them so they could be with their owners for all eternity. They also mummified mice so the cats would have something to eat in the afterlife. Today, people often keep cats as pets, but there are also cats that live without being cared for by people. These kinds of cats are called feral cats. Today, special food for cats is widely available in the developed countries. Proper feeding will make a cat live much longer compared to hunting or being fed table scraps. Not correctly feeding a cat can lead to problems. Cats cannot taste sweet foods with sugar because of a mutation or change in their ancestors which remove the ability to taste sweet things. Cat anatomy. Cats have anatomy similar to the other members of the genus Felis. The genus has extra lumbar, or lower back, and thoracic, or chest vertebrae. This helps to explain this cat's spinal mobility and flexibility. Unlike human arms, cat forelimbs are attached to the shoulder by free-floating clavicle bones. These allow cats to pass their bodies through any space into which they can fit their heads. The cat skull is unusual among mammals in having very large eye sockets and a powerful and specialized jaw. Compared to other felines, domestic cats have narrowly spaced canine teeth. This is an adaptation to their preferred prey of small rodents. Cats, like dogs, walk directly on their toes with the bones of their feet making up the lower part of the visible leg. Cats walk very precisely. Unlike most mammals, when cats walk, they use a pacing gait. That is, they move the two legs on one side of the body before the legs on the other side. This trait is shared with camels and giraffes. As a walk speeds up into a trot, a cat's gait will change to be a diagonal gait, similar to that of most other mammals. The diagonally opposite hind and forelegs will move at the same time. Most cats have five claws on their front paws and four on their rear paws. On the inside of the front paws, there is something which looks like a sixth finger. This special feature on the inside of wrists 
is the carpal pad, also found on other cats and on dogs. Behavior. Cats are active carnivores, meaning they hunt live prey. Their main prey is small mammals like mice. They will also stalk and sometimes kill and eat birds. Cats eat a wide variety of prey, including insects, and seem especially to like the houseflies and bluebottles. Their main method of hunting is stalk and pounce. While dogs have great stamina and will chase prey over long distances, cats are extremely fast, but only over short distances. The basic cat coat coloring, tabby, gives it a good camouflage in grass and woodland. The cat creeps towards a chosen victim, keeping its body flat and near to the ground so that it cannot be seen easily until it is close enough for a rapid dash or pounce. Cats, especially kittens, practice these instinctive behaviors in play with each other or on small toys. Cats are quiet and well-behaved animals, making them popular pets. Young kittens are playful. They can easily entertain themselves with a variety of store-bought or homemade toys. House cats have also been known to teach themselves how to use level-type doorknobs, lever-type doorknobs, and toilet handles. Cats are fairly independent animals. They can look after themselves and do not need as much attention as dogs do. Communication. Cats use many different sounds for communication, including meowing, purring, trilling, hissing, growling, squeaking, chirping, clicking, and grunting. Body posture is also important. The whole shape of the body changes when a cat is relaxed or when it is alert. Also, the position of their ears and tail are used for communication, as well as their usual functions. These ways of communication are very important. They are used between a mother cat and her kittens. They are also used between male and female cats, and between cats and other species, such as dogs. A mother cat protecting her kittens will fight off the largest dog. She gives good warning with a frightening display, hissing furiously, showing her claws, arching her back, and making her hair stand on end. If that fails, she attacks the dog's face with her claws. It has been said that no dog ever tries such an attack a second time. Reproduction. The gestation period for cats is about two months with an average length of 66 days. The size of a litter is usually three to five kittens. Kittens are weaned at between six and seven weeks and cats normally reach sexual maturity at five to 10 months for females and to five to seven months for males. Females can have two to three litters per year, so might produce up to 150 kittens in their breeding life of about 10 years. Pregnant females deliver their litters by themselves, guided by instinct. They find the safest place they can. Then they will clean it thoroughly with their tongues if necessary. Here, they will quietly give birth. Kittens play endlessly. It is how they do their learning. They will play their favorite games, such as hide and pounce, with almost anyone or anything. Soft balls on strings are a standard toy. So is a scratching post. With cats, there is a limit to how far you can train them. They're at least as intelligent as dogs, but they are not pack animals. If your kitten was born in your home, do not let it out of the house until it is two to three months old. Grooming. Cats are very clean animals. They groom themselves by licking their fur. A cat's tongue can act as a hairbrush and clean and untangle a cat's fur. Still, owners may buy grooming products to help the cat take care of itself. After licking their fur, cats can sometimes get hairballs. A hairball is a small amount of fur that is vomited up by animals when it becomes too big. This is quite normal. Owners brush their cats to try to prevent a lot of hairballs. Food. Many house cats eat food which their owners give them. This food is manufactured and designed to contain the right nutrients for cats. 
There are many different types of cat food. These come in many different flavors and costs are often very small. There is moist canned food and also dry cat food, which comes in different size cans or bags and formulas. There are kitten formulas, cat formulas, health formulas, formulas for reducing a cat's weight, and many others. These can even be organic, which is made from all natural ingredients, and have vegetables, salmon, tuna, meat, and milk essence. Yet, it's best if the food is at least 95% meat, as that's a cat's diet. Also, make sure the cat is not fed a daily diet of dog food. It could make the cat blind, as it has no taurine, which is a nutrient for the eyes. Health Concerns Cats do get diseases, and prevention is better than cure. It is most important to get a young cat vaccinated against some of the most deadly diseases. If a cat gets a disease, a veterinarian or animal doctor can offer help. Some cats, depending on breed, gender, age, and general health, may be more susceptible to disease than others. Regular visits to a vet can help keep a cat alive many extra years by catching sickness and disease early. Cats that roam outside will get fleas at some time. Cat fleas will not live on people, but fleas will not hesitate to bite anyone nearby. Owners may choose to buy anti-flea collars, but any areas where the cat normally sleeps needs to be cleaned up. A vet or local pet shop may offer advice about fleas. It is recommended that people quickly take action when a cat gets fleas because fleas can make cats uncomfortable. House cats can become overweight through lack of exercise and overfeeding. When they get spayed or neutered, or fixed, they tend to exercise less. Spaying is done for queens and neutering is done for toms. It is important to fix cats, and here are some reasons. First of all, if a female cat has kittens, they will need homes. Finding homes for kittens is often quite difficult. If a tom is not fixed, it develops a disgusting smell. Breeders who have entire toms keep them in a special hut outside the house for that reason. Fixing also helps to avoid overpopulation. Overpopulation means that there are too many cats and some will need to be put to sleep or put down in animal pounds and animal shelters. Kittens are sometimes born with defects. People who receive cats as gifts are recommended to get it examined for its health. Some birth defects, like heart problems, require urgent vet attention. Others are harmless, like polydactyly. Polydactyly means many digits, or many fingers, from poly, which is many, and dactyl, which means digit. Sometimes there is a mutation or change in cat families. Most cats only have four to five toes per paw, depending on whether it is the front or back paw. These mutated cats have six, seven, and in rare cases, even more. All of these cats are called polydactyl cats. They can also be called Hemingway cats because author Hermes, Ernest Hemingway owned many of these cats. Other meanings of the word cat. As a verb, to cat means to pull a ship's anchor to rest at its cat head. Cat can also be a short nickname for Catherine, Kathleen, Caitlin, Catalina, Katrina, and Katerina. Well, that's everything you could want to know about cats. Do any of you have any of these names? Are any of you nicknamed cat? Do you have a cat? You're so lucky. Not everyone has a pet in the world. And if you can't have a dog, then a cat is a pretty good pet. They're furry and cuddly, and they can clean themselves too. I can't do that. My mommy and daddy have to bathe me in the bathtub, and I hate it. I have a song about bath time that I'll share with you one of these Music Mondays. Thanks for listening to all these great facts about cats. And don't forget to subscribe so you can find me again. Be sure to join me on Friday for Chapter 3 of our ongoing story, Pep, the Story of a Brave Dog. See you then! Bye!